anyway I'm back here again there's four receivers I have 5.8 1.2 900 and uh, 2.4 gigahertz so I'm playing with all of the uh, different settings now this thing's gonna work good out here because it's a real sensitive camera and you can see right here I have the telemetry there's the antenna for it and I have the 2.0 mega board here's a battery checker and then over here I have the orange receiver and the camera goes on top here or around here somewhere so I use goggles on this tree my transmitter receiver tree and I will be doing uh, hanging a I will be hanging the other air the, the air module for the uh, telemetry up on top here so right now I'm charging through the battery here of my van and I got a 5,000 zippy here going right now it's upside down and here's my little setup piggyback camera it shoots it down to this is a I think it's a 1.2 for this camera this uh, set up here anywhere from 900 to 1.2 gigahertz and it likes 8 volts this battery so it's easier it's lighter on the on the quad or any other aircraft that I fly it on these uh, foam noodle tubes from the swimming pools work pretty good for uh, shock I already had it fall out of the sky from about 30 feet up it just bounced and fell over and I lost one of the legs I just glued it back on but it works real well I'm pleased with it there's another extension that goes on here another aluminum extension I will be putting it up it'll go up about to uh, 10 to 12 feet up and that's good enough does not have to be real high so that's it I'm gonna be shutting down here because I know I got a little bit of color lines in this thing today is by the way November 18th Monday 2012 and it's about three or four o'clock p.m. we don't get that much daylight now so yeah, I'm gonna be cutting it off um, my friend here <laughs>